Simon's going to do it. It's time for Gunter to go up. Yes, welcome to the part of the show that features a clever person and a kids' TV presenter. Now, last week live here on the Saturday show, this happened. Five, four, three, two, one. Poor old Simon getting covered again, but we can't really work out what happens here on the Saturday show. Maybe it's the pressure of the gunge, maybe it's the pressure of the booth, maybe it's extremely tough questions. But later that same evening, Simon went on to test the nation with some other celebs to see just what his IQ is. We all thought we knew what was going to happen. How wrong were we? Check this out. In joint third place, we have Simon Grant. <laughs> He's joint third with Jenny Bond, and the two of you got 113. Congratulations. <laughs> Have you amazed yourself, Simon? George's TV presenter, yes. Yay! Look at that. He turned up in a school uniform and ended up being joint fourth. That, that was very impressive, same as Jenny Bond. I know. Joint with kind of royalty. Yeah, well, she's on the news, so she must be really clever, mustn't she? She's very clever. All right, what can I say? Well played. And I'm hoping to say well played to someone else that's joining us right now. Please welcome Royster, everybody. Yay! Rojda Ildarim, what are you doing sat in there? I hope I get gunged. What are you doing? That's my was an interesting answer to the question. I think Simon's got a massive grin on his face right now. Now, this is the way... I, I can see it in the green <laughs> You can stay right there. What you need to do is try not to get guns. And if you don't get guns today, Roger, what we're going to do is give you this brilliant Saturday show MP3 player. And if you do, it's still all good, because not only do you get guns, which you want to get, uh, then you also get an I've been gunged on the Saturday show certificate. So, every time you lose a life, Angelica starts to smile, and eventually she'll be plunging the guns, won't you, baby? That's right. When all five lives are lost, the guns get plunged. Okay, it's now time to go on with the game. Roger, you're the guest. You can go first. Your first topic is... Okay, it's friends. Roger, play or pass? Pass. You're going to pass. Okay, Simon, did you watch the last episode last night? I was revising for today's Saturday show, but okay. I, I've been chatting to uh, James and he's given me the... No, Which... Let's move on. Which character in Friends sings about a smelly cat? <laughs> Phoebe! It is yeah. Phoebe! Royster, I'm afraid. You passed and then you lost the life. Unlucky to you. In goes your gunge. <laughs> OK, Simon, here we go. Horticulture. Simon, oh, play or pass on no. horticulture? Horticulture? Uh, I, I'm going to play. OK, you're going to play. Simon, who was recently buried in the Blue Peter Garden? Horticulture? What, as fertiliser? No. Oh! Certainly not okay. fertiliser. Okay, George the Blue Peter Tortoise. George the Blue Peter Tortoise, well played. Roger, I'm afraid that's two lives lost instantly for you. Let's move on. Okay, you can redeem yourself here. Oh, hold on a minute. So I'm just going to be nice. Sort yourself out now. Thank you. Sort yourself out now. Thank you, man. Sort yourself out now. What's it going to be? Music. Stupid computer. Roger, play a part on music. Play? You're going to play. I think you need to. You've lost two lives already. Who is the youngest member of the band Blue who are doing karaoke on the Saturday show? Is it Anthony? Anthony's 22 years old. Lee is 19. Lee is the right answer. You've lost another life. You're not doing this on purpose, are you? 40, really, anyway. OK, so I said that, not me. You're in trouble. OK, Simon, you're up next. Play or pass on potluck. Now, potluck can either be really hard or really easy. So, are you feeling lucky? Uh, I'm lucky. Feeling lucky. Feeling OK. Lucky. Which couple recently called their baby Apple? For I know. Start, I, I thought the same thing. OK, I'm not even going to say it. Um, a couple called their name Apple. Is It must be a celebrity couple. It's a celebrity Nobody couple. Nobody called them their baby Apple. Um, oh, I know. Is it Gwyneth Paltrow? And, uh, ah, uh, 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 Chris Martin. You're saying Gwyneth Paltrow and Chris yeah, Martin. If you get this right, Roger has just one life left. If you get it wrong, oh, she's well in with a shout. Me. I can tell you now, you're right. Roger, oh. you lose a life again! Oh. <sighs> OK, Roger, here we go. OK, Roger, song lyrics. First of all, play or pass? I've got to pass. 
Okay, you're gonna pass Watch straight that. away. You crazy Simon. fool. <laughs> you crazy fool. Crazy fool. If you get this question right, Roger gets the gun. Right. Okay. Can you name the band and the song title from these lyrics? The song has gone multi-platinum. Everybody bought our seventh album. The song has gone multi-platinum. Everyone bought the seventh album. Everyone, someone's on multi-platinum. I can't even say it. I think it. Um, is it? Uh, do, do, do I know them? <laughs> uh, oh, no idea. Ty, so, do you have an answer? Busted. Must be busted. You say busted? Yeah. Yeah. I need the song title. Is it, is it really busted? I need the band. That was a guess. I need the band and the song title. I can't tell you whether you're right oh, or wrong. Oh, um, no, uh, I can't think of any busted. Nothing at all. Got okay. completely from me. It is busted, but. Ooh. Okay, it was in fact busted. Year 3000. Roger, you're back in it. <laughs> well played. Okay. <laughs> okay, this is films. Simon, play or pass on play. films. Okay, again, if you get this right. Rushter gets gunged. Sorry, Rushter. What kind of fish was Nemo in Finding Nemo? What kind of fish? Yeah. What type of fish? The colourful fish. A pretty fish. <laughs> Simon, do you have an answer? But a clownfish. OK. Is it... Simon says a clownfish. If this is right, <laughs> Rushter <laughs> is going to get gunged. I can tell you right now, Nemo was, in fact, a clownfish! <laughs> Roger, I'm afraid you're getting guns! Simon, so how do you feel? So that's what it looks like. I, I, I forgot what it what it's like <laughs> to be clean. Just tell us for the viewers at home, how does it feel? It's it's like a, a fresh apple. Nice. Let's have a very quick look at the replay there. This is Roger getting absolutely covered in nasty guns. Look at that. She bent down, but not even that protected her from the power of guns. And I suppose the moral of the story is. Don't call our bluff. If you turn up here telling us you want to get gunged, it just might happen. And if watching Roger has made you think, I want to get gunged, you must be strange and you must write to this address. The address is The Saturday Show, PO Box 9212, Glasgow, G128ZH. Or, of course, you can email us, The Saturday Show at bbc.co.uk. Roger, all I can say is congratulations. We're going to give you an I've Been Gunged on The Saturday Show certificate. Give us a thumbs up. <laughs> give us a thumbs up. That's it. Yep, she can't quite hear me. Obviously got guns in the ears. Right now it's time for Woody Woodpecker and he's a private detective. Woo!